reading from our God, from the Psalms of our teacher and prophet, King David, Psalms 55. May the blessings of our God be with us always. Amen. Listen to my prayer, God. Do not ignore my request. Hear me and respond. My thoughts trouble me from within, and I am distraught because of what my enemies are saying about me, because of the threats of the wicked, for they bring down suffering on me and assail me to anger. My heart is anguishing within. The terrors of death have fallen on me. Fear and trembling have beset me, and a horror has overwhelmed me, God. I said, oh, that I had the wings of a dove, I would just fly off and be at rest. Yet I would flee far away and stay away from this desert. I would hurry to my place of shelter, far from the tempest and the storms of this life. Lord, confuse the wicked, confound their words, for I see violence and strife all around my city. Day and night they prowl about on its walls, malice and abusing everyone. Destructive forces are at work in the city. Threats and lies never leave its streets. If an enemy were insulting me, I could take it, God. If an enemy, if a foe, simply rose against me, I could hide. But it is you, a man like myself, my companion, my close friend, the one whom I ate together with. At the house of God, as we walked about among the worshipers, let death take my enemies by surprise. Let them go down alive to the realm of the dead, to the underworld, for evil finds lodging among them. As for me, but as for me, I will call on my God, and the Master will rescue me. Evening, morning, and noon, I cry out in distress, and He hears my voice. He rescues the unharmed from the battle waged against Him. Even though many oppose Him, God, who is enthroned from old, who does not change, will hear them and humble them because they have no respect for him. My companion attacks his friends. He violates his promise. He talks in smooth talk like butter, yet war is in his heart. His words are more soothing than oil, yet they are drawn like a weapon. Cast your cares on our God. Cast your cares on the master, for he will support you. He will sustain you, and he will never let the good. He will never let those who depend on him down. He will not let them be shaken, but you, God, will bring down the evil into a pit of destruction. Those who thirst for blood, those who lie, will not live out even half their days, but as for me, I will trust in you.